Hi, this is Pat Love with Pat's Two Cents. You know, one of our viewers asked me to deal with them having a struggle with always trying to be a pleaser, always trying to be liked and please man, not man and gender, just mankind, period. Uh, a lot of us don't realize how needy we can be and how much we need love and we need approval. So we end up pleasing to a fault. And this is what she wanted to deal with. Now, this is what I want you to hear. This is what God says about this. Isaiah chapter 2, verse 22. Cease ye from man, whose breath is in his nostrils. For wherein is he to be accounted of? Yeah, okay, I'll put that, Pat's two cents. I'll put it in layman's term, terms. Quit tripping off of what man thinks. He breathes in and out just like you. So why you put so much store in that? Okay, now I'm going to read one more verse. I want you to hear this. And, okay, let's see here. Now, I love this one. This one deals with treasures. Huh. This one says, lay not up treasures. I got to say it the correct way. Uh, okay, here we go. Matthew 6, verse 19. Listen up. Lay not up for yourselves treasures upon earth, where moth and rust doth corrupt, and where thieves break through and steal. Verse 20, but lay up for yourselves treasures in heaven where neither moth doth nor rust doth corrupt and where thieves do not break through nor steal. Now, there's another scripture that says where your, tre where your treasure is there will your heart be also. Now, what I want to say to you is this. We all go through this. We grow up wanting to please mommy and daddy. We grow up wanting to have friends. We want to be popular. We don't want to be the rejects of society. So we end up doing things we really don't want to do because someone else is making it seem like it's important to them. Probably ain't about nothing, but anyway. But we get so tied up in knots about, oh, will they be offended if I don't do this, that, or the other? Will they stop liking me? Will, will uh, that make them upset with me? Well, what God is saying in essence is, quit tripping. What they care about, I mean, what their opinion of you is, is of no importance. Quit putting so much value on that. Quit tripping. Cease from man. Stop it. Quit it. Listen. And then when he talks about putting your treasures on things above, that just doesn't talk about love and peace and joy and harmony and faith. No. That's talking about, and it, and it's not talking about gold or, you know, flesh. No. What it's dealing with is when you put so much store, it's another one. When you put so much store in earthly things, you worry about the, the beggarly things, the things that really don't matter, and the weightier things that count to God, that God value, values. We, if we're too earthly minded, we're not going to be too spiritually good because those things won't carry much weight in our hearts because we're too busy grappling down here for somebody to like me. Do you like me? Do you like me? Oh, you don't like me. Oh, what am I going to do? What am I going to do? What am I going to do? I got to do something to make them like me. And you're putting too much store on beggarly elements when God is saying, hey, look up. There, there are treasures up here. 
that's what I have placed in your life. You hear what I'm saying? Okay, think about that. God bless you.